How is it possible to create your best life while the world feels as though a pause button is being pushed and the future is so uncertain? Wow. Great observation and great question that so many people probably have top of mind right now is how do you create a future when there seems to be this pause button going on with the pandemic, especially that has us feel like our future is uncertain. It's because we create our future now in the present. We might think that it shows up and this random situation is happening and then there we are, you know, having to, to contend with that. But if we are present now, then we will align with the things that we know make us feel as though we're connected and at ease and at peace and aligned with the creative self that we are, the true creative self we are, the ray of the sun of the great creator, we're the created that can create just like the creator, never been dropped with that same capacity. But when we're looking at the outside world and, and towards the future to give us all of our um, permission or signs for what we're going to be doing in the future, then we won't be really living from our heart of hearts. And the point is to begin to live from our heart of hearts, no matter what's going on outside, to have no excuses and to have no reasons or conditions that make us show up conditional. We want to be unconditionally in alignment with the divine and completely unconditioned by the outside world. So let yourself become present now and each and every day make that a practice to the best of your capacity in whatever way feels most natural to you. To just say, I want to connect now, I want to breathe in the light, I want to be in and of the light, I want to be connected to my creative self now, or better yet, I'm gonna cancel that, I said I want to, say I am connected to the light of the truth of me because that is the truth you already are connected we're just the ones that disconnect and then think we're not i surrender now to the peace and ease and brilliance of me i allow myself to show up in an unconditional way and allow myself to unconditionally accept all the beauty and life and creativity that i am and have in this moment as accessible to me now and i'm going to create my future from this present place that anything I resonate with now in this love, I'm going to attract and I'm going to receive gratefully and I'm going to extend and expand that out into the world. I'm going to share it and give it and let myself be unquantifiable in my expression of the divine. Just let yourself be present now and you'll notice that the future will unfold perfectly. Let the future take care of itself. Don't defend against the future. Just be present and available to yourself now and you'll hear and feel and intuit everything you're meant to do to show up to the most beautiful and brilliant future. So important to stay present now, just even to stay safe and healthy and well in this world. Let yourself be guided by the divinity of you each and every day in a small and present way, even what you're touching or what you're tasting or what you're connecting with or or disconnected from, let it all be divinely guided, and then the bigger picture will unfold. But it unfolds moment by moment, cherishing and relishing and savoring every moment. And then there's no arriving. You're just going to evolve into the future and watch how that then evolves. And you'll see yourself being present every day, all day. That's the best of all worlds. That is enlightenment. That's why we came here, to reconnect, to return to love.